good to see the likes of Scottish rugby legends Ross Ford and Greg Laidlaw paying a visit and supporting the children who thoroughly enjoyed their time at Netherdale on Saturday. The event itself has grown into one of the biggest sports and entertainments events in the borders and it culminated with the main sevens event on the big pitch. Much to the delight of the local fans, Gala went through their pool unbeaten and were favourites along with two Scots to reach the final. But Kelso and Selkirk overturned their unbeaten opponents to reach the final themselves and set up an interesting match between the two border sides. Selkirk had made the Gala Sevens final ten times over the years, but won only once back in 2009. Kelso, on the other hand, had not won the Gala Trophy for 22 years, so plenty at stake for both teams. Selkirk got their noses in front just before the break with a couple of tries, but Kelso clogged back to level the scores at half-time. From then on, it was one-way traffic, as Kelso piled on the points to take the Gala title, to add to their Peebles success two weeks before, and they'll take a maximum 20 points into the third round at Melrose next April. But while Sevens hibernates for the winter, the 15 season is just around the corner in two weeks' time, with four Borders teams in the Premiership. Stuart Cameron, ITV News, Gala Shields.